Hey, Mr. Parker here to review one from MVD, and this is the Haunted Trailer, or Haunted Trailer. Uh, I put this in, I was thinking, I don't know about this one with the cover art and anything, but I must say that I was pleasantly surprised with it. I found myself laughing and uh, wanting to throw up in equal parts. Uh, it's not like an extreme film or anything like that. It's just completely dirty, raunchy, sleazy, incestuous stuff in here. Uh, what happens is this ghost gets, uh, this demon accidentally gets awakened. Uh, he's in a little statue, and uh, it's Ron Jeremy, and he ends up, all his scenes seem to be shot off camera, and he ends up just, uh, being there, you know, they shot his scene separate and he'll look like pop up on the TV or be a little uh, computer thing over on the side. The computer effects in this movie aren't too great, but that's not really what the movie's about. It's really more for the uh, gross gags and laughs and things like that. The two brothers in here are amazing. They're really gross and uh, do lots of gross things. Uh, this guy right here is in Conjoined, and this is actually the director of Conjoined. He plays the mother. He's a, a cross-dresser in this or whatever. He's playing a, a male playing a female. He does a pretty funny job. He even has his freaking catchphrase, God damn it. But, uh, yeah, really what makes this movie is the performance from the lead four and uh, the guy here, the reverend in here, Praise Jesus. He's actually hilarious in this movie. Uh, there's a bunch of also fake trailers on here that will have you in uh, tears, you know, uh, Penny on a tape, Penny on tape, uh, Thunder, Lightning, Beer, just really stupid stuff like that. It's, uh, you know, I guess it's exploitation in a way. Uh, there's just, like, I don't want to get into exactly some of the details. There's just really gross things, like one of the brother's assholes hurts, so the other brother shoves a popsicle up there, and just things like that, really gross, incestuous things. Uh, I am the Spooky Man. Like you did the third grade. I brought you something. Oh, what? Oh, Popsy Eagle, thank yeah. you. You ain't supposed to eat it, stupid. Wow. Dang. Huh? Wait, oh, oh, yeah. 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 Oh, you like that? Yeah. Is that I better? Like that. I love that. Yeah? You sure? Oh, yeah. Go deep. All right. Go All right. Oh, yeah, like you feel better? That feel better? Yeah, yeah. You, you like that? A lot, a lot. All right, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my toes are curling. Yeah. My toes are curling. Oh, yeah. Hey, y'all, what's going on? Have you been plunging a popsicle up your brother's ass and made him shit all over your sister again? Yes, Mama. <laughs> Uh, the, the daughter sleeps with everyone in the movie. There's actually, oh, there is some nudity in the very beginning, which is pretty funny. Like I said, the movie is driven by the, the main four cast members doing a really exceptional job and just lots of lots of gross uh, fart joke humor, but it's actually funny stuff. Stuff that uh, is strong enough to make me like, Ugh, or oh my god, just shake your head in uh, repulsion. Uh, Ron Jeremy's in the film, but most of his stuff is you, I think it was shot uh, separately and they kind of added it in. He does pretty uh, decent in it, but you can again tell he was never actually there, or he may have been, but it, it didn't look like it to me. Uh, the digital effects aren't uh, anything amazing, I don't think. Uh, there's no real gore or anything like that. There's lots of poop flying around on people's faces. This is that type of movie. And uh, it says here, some people say, like, early John Waters work. And you know what? I know I have tons of John Waters movies. I have not seen too many of them. I've only seen a couple, you know. But so I wouldn't make that comparison. But I would say that is a raunchy, nasty, good time that will uh, leave you laughing. Uh, if if this is your sort of thing, then you gotta really see it. Don't be fooled by you know the kind of generic cover and whatnot. And also this guy, the Reverend in here is uh, exceptionally funny as well. So what you're looking at is just this lowbrow fart humor that's actually equal parts gross, equal parts funny. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good one. <laughs> We need a bath of holy water to cleanse the demon within. That's it, Reverend Wiggum. Good girl. And now to bless this tub. <laughs>